Hello everyone and welcome. In today's video we are going to talk about 10 eyeshadow palettes that I recommend for spring. So if you're curious about that, go ahead and keep on watching. So what I usually like to wear during springtime, I like to wear a lot of corally shades, a lot of orange shades. I do like a little bit of like green and a little bit of like lavender and types like that. A little bit of pink as well, but I also need some nudes. You know, I need some, some of my coral shades, I need some dusty pinks, I need some browns. That's what I usually like to wear during the springtime. So without further ado, uh, let's get into these little palettes over here. Right, so number 10, we have a really beautiful um, eyeshadow palette. The formula is a little bit complicated to play with, but once you get the gist of it, it is gorgeous. And the colors, are just screaming for me these colors are screaming mermaid i know for some people mermaid screams uh summertime for me it screams springtime and i do love these shades right here on the bottom part these are definitely really suitable for spring but also this um top ones that are a little bit darker in combination with the lighter ones you can create some really beautiful looks but this one is on number 10 just because it is a little bit darker so to speak okay for spring but i do love to wear those type of things in spring as well all right so number nine we have a colorful one so this is from almar cosmetics and this one reina de caribe uh volume one and this one it is actually uh, discontinued on their website I had it for quite a while but I love it I love it and I just cannot make myself get rid of it I absolutely love these two shades right here freaking love them so this both are a little bit more on the orangey shade this is a lighter one this is a very deep one and it's so beautiful and i also love these two right here these are some beautiful buttery um, mattes but the shimmers to die for they're so good and also you can actually use a little bit of a wet uh, brush with them and it's gonna create even more intense look so i absolutely love to wear this in the spring my favorite favorite look is just to put these two on the lid like half and half and just call it a day and i mm, i love it i love this eyeshadow palette so much and i love it for the springtime for me it's perfect for this now next one in here i have this one from urban decay and this one is called g train on the run palette this one i have not played with it as much as i should but this one has a lot of those beautiful shades that i was talking about it has some or it has some golds over here it has some coral shades over here it has these two greens as well which i really really love as well and then the breakdown is really pretty um but yeah this one is very it's a very compact one but also has enough colors in there to give you a beautiful to give you options to create some beautiful looks for all right on number seven we have a violet fast one so this one is the essentials one i had the opportunity to play with this one a lot last year um and i really really i mean really love these shades these this pink and this dusty pink together are mm, so good and then if you put that plum just a little bit on the outer corner super and then also if you go with these two right these three right here very beautiful 
a neutral look and then this gold with the emerald and then you put a little bit of that black or you can add a little bit of that brown just such beautiful looks that it can create with this one and it just i love it i love it i cannot wait to play with that pink and the dusty rose that's just gonna be that's gonna be a look that's gonna be a look that you're probably gonna see in in the future videos next in line it's huda beauty we have huda beauty medium nude obsession i got this this winter and um i only played a few times with it but every time i play with it i love it um it's definitely a nude it has a lot of corally shades that i talked about it has a little bit of the ooh, a little bit of that warm um bronzy shades you know what i mean and uh, it is so pretty i love it it's so pretty and it's definitely really nice to just kind of create something very quickly without having any problems for example you can do this one right here and then you can add this on top just beautiful beautiful or you can even do this one with this one on top it's just like i feel like you just go with the whole shade the matte shade on your eye and then you just put the um the sparkly one the metallic one in the center there you go it's just perfect it doesn't even matter which one you mix and match because it's gonna look amazing no matter what so next one in here is a little bit older this is the i love sarahi dose of color <sighs> this color this eyeshadow palette i created an eye look that i just freaking drooled over and i loved it so freaking much um and that's why i love to wear this in the spring so i know this one has like some colors that don't make sense but some colors that do make sense so for example this and this are really beautiful but i love to wear them with the green and then i love that black you can add a lot of dimension with it it has some beautiful sparkles in there and then also you have these two right here the golden one and this one that is more like a pinky it has more of a pinky base just so gorgeous definitely worth it to be in a spring to be worn in the spring oh this one so this one it's zoeva caramel melange this one is everything i want in a palette <laughs> like look at those shades i know for a lot of people they feel like these shades are too close to each other but let me tell you they are gorgeous on the eyes and they do look different when you put them on the eyes now another thing about these i love love those mattes they're so easy to blend one of the easiest eyeshadow palette uh to blend so i absolutely love those the shimmers are the only ones in here that i'm like mm, they could be a little bit more intense but the mattes the mattes are just everything for me in this palette the mattes are just everything and also i just love this plum right here this plum right here is this so freaking gorgeous on the eye um and also this orange i love it all right we are getting for the top three in the third place i decided to go with two eyeshadow palettes and both of these are from colourpop and these are the ones so first of all i have the sailor moon x colourpop pretty guardian eyeshadow palette and this one is so pretty it has some really beautiful shades in there the bottom row how i'm showing it right here doesn't quite show up on my skin tone so i have to definitely use only these right here but this one is a really really beautiful eyeshadow palette and i love sailor moon and i just love playing with this yellow right here it is one of the best yellows i have in my collection and yellows are very hard to find and then this lavender it's such a pretty shade i love 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 this and luna together just a look it's just a look gorgeous gorgeous this one um and 
This one is one of my favorite eyeshadow palettes from ColourPop. I think this was one of the best collaborations they ever made um, because those greens. Those greens are such unique green shades that I have not seen in every uh, any other eyeshadow palette. And they're just so amazing quality as well that it's incredible. They were able to put all of this together. It's incredible in my mind. And then they have some others that are like shit. You know what I mean? But this eyeshadow palette... Mm, so beautiful so beautiful i love those greens i love this shimmer that is like a like a war it's like a a gold green just just beautiful beautiful all right so top two top two i i knew from the beginning which one is gonna be on number one because i knew okay <laughs> but on the second place i was i was having a, a, a little bit of a problem like where do i put it or if i put it on second place or if i put it on third place i was unsure of it but i decided to put it on second place because i feel like this eyeshadow palette it screams spring to me so this is the mercury retrograde Huda Beauty, from Huda Beauty. So there you go. There's just such beautiful shades in here and definitely screams spring to me. Like you can create some gorgeous eye looks with this one and you have those beautiful shimmers as well. So absolutely gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. I tried it a bunch of times. Um, There's a few shades in here that I'm like, eh. I don't like the formula that much, but there's some that are absolutely beautiful in here. The shimmers are the ones that makes this palette. Do you know which one is going to be on number one? Do you have any idea? Hmm? Well, <laughs> number one is an eyeshadow palette that I recently bought and recently tried but it made me feel some sort of way when I tried it that I have never experienced before and this eyeshadow palette it is Tiny Marvels with, which is a collaboration between Sydney Grace and Mel Thompson absolutely beautiful eyeshadow palette but the shimmers in here oh, oh. The shimmers in here are from a different galaxy. I just, I can't. The shimmers in here are absolutely delicious, gorgeous, beautiful. The mattes, they blend themselves. The colors are just so, so pretty. And I totally think this screams spring. This screams every day. This screams um, even if you go like a really crazy party and you want to be super glamorous, you can create looks with this one. If you're just going to the grocery store, you still can be able to create a very natural and beautiful look with this one. This one for me, is just it's just gorgeous let me know what it is one of the eyeshadow palettes that it would just say screams screams spring in your um in your collection let me know down below thank you so much for watching and i will see you all next time bye